Hey guys, and welcome to a food review with John's brother. If you're expecting John, he should be in for the next one. Um, but I usually don't do these myself, but I found something in the store the other day that caught my attention, and I figured I would give it a try because I haven't seen a whole lot about it yet on the internet, which makes me think that it's still fairly new and something that could possibly mean we'd get the most views on YouTube if we review it first. Um, so there are three new flavors of Cheez-Its. As you can see, the one I was holding was cheese pizza. The other one is cheeseburger and cheesy nachos. So they're all cheese themed. Um, but you choose the champion. Your vote decides which one is going to stay um, for good. And you can tweet your vote at cheezit.com slash vote. Uh, but like I said, I haven't seen a whole lot about this yet. Um, and I just wanted to take a moment to do it myself. So I'm going to review all three, just eat a couple, let you know what my thoughts are, starting with cheese pizza. Let's see, you get a little bit of that flavor uh, powder and your typical kind of cheese it baked snack. So, much like anything that you would have that's pizza flavored, chip or cracker, it tastes like they uh, dusted some tomato flavoring on it and called it pizza flavored. Not to say that I don't like it, because I do like that tomato flavor, but it's very overpowering. To say it's cheese pizza, I would say that's more of a tomato cheese it. You kind of do get that after flavor of the baked cheddar that you typically get in the cheese its but um, very tomato-y. I do like it, but don't expect um, that cheese flavor with the tomato being very overpowering. Number two, cheeseburger. Um, not as much to see. It's like a slight yellow dusting of powder on this one. Uh, but let's give this a try. Actually, I'm going to keep the box out. I want to point something out. When you, uh, again, expect cheeseburger flavor in a chip or cracker, what you're typically going to receive is something that tastes like mustard and pickles. Um, not to say that there isn't both mustard and pickles on the box, but there's also meat, cheese, onions, tomato, ketchup, something tomato flavored. Um, and you don't really get that. What you get is mustard and pickle. And again, the aftertaste of the baked Cheez-It. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say, these aren't baked any differently than the regular Cheez-Its. It's just a regular cheddar Cheez-It, but with a flavor powder. Um, so you'll get that kind of cheddar cheese flavor in the background. Since it's been like 30 seconds since I had the last one, I can really taste just the regular Cheez-It. Not so much the mustard and pickle. But that's what you're getting the most of. Not a very meaty flavor, not a very cheesy flavor up front, not a lot of onion or tomato or anything else from it. Mustard and pickle. Number three, cheddar nachos. I can't imagine this one would be hard to mess up. It's literally just cheese. See, there's kind of a more black, peppery looking powder to this one.
So that's definitely the cheesiest one because it's to be expected, it's a cheddar nacho. There's a mild, 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 mild kick to it. Very little tiny bit. I don't do spicy well, but that's completely fine. Um, it's just enough to give it a little kick, and I like that a lot. Um, the cheddar cheese flavor itself reminds me of if you'd get nacho cheese at a ball game or a bowling alley or arcade or something like that where it's just kind of like the liquidy cheese. Um, it tastes a lot like that, but with a mild kick. Not a whole lot to it, but as far as the, um, the name cheese it goes, that's definitely representing the cheese portion best. Of the three, um, my vote would probably be for Team Cheeseburger because even though I was a little disappointed that it's just a mustard and pickle flavor, the aftertaste of that one is very much a baked cheddar cheese it and you do end up getting that good cheesy flavor when you're done eating it and mixes well with the mustard and the pickle flavor. So my vote would be for the cheeseburger cheese it to remain in existence. Pizza is nothing special, it's what you've had with every other pizza flavored item imaginable. And the nacho one, you may as well go out and buy the Tabasco cheese it for it. I think cheeseburger offers you the most unique um, flavor experience and yeah so these are the three new Cheez-Its cheeseburger cheese pizza and cheddar nachos um, make sure you go out and try and find these whenever you can and give them a shot vote for which one you think should be remaining and kick out the other two that you don't hope you enjoy the video and I hope you enjoy John from here on out